All right, so here is my long overdue update. I'm sorry I've been keeping you guys in the dark. I've had people asking me, where have I been? Why haven't made any updates? I have just been really busy, whereas most people have, you know, nine months to prepare. I've had like two months. So I was kind of just going to give you an update of what's been going on. Um, we did decide on a name, and I said that in another video, but um, we did choose on the name Jameson. So Sawyer and Jameson, yay! Say hi, everybody. <laughs> you are too cute. Um, as far as preparing for this baby and buying stuff, for him, we're really having to buy a whole lot of things since we already have a lot of stuff already. And we already have a lot of clothes that were, you know, same season. And Sawyer, I went crazy with Sawyer. There was a lot of times he never, you know, he never wore, there's a lot of clothes he never even wore. And um, I did buy this baby, baby Jameson. I did buy him some clothes too. So he's got plenty of clothes. He's got a bed. He's got everything he needs. And um, so I really don't, I didn't really need all that much stuff. I mean, I did get another little bathtub sponge or whatever and. I do not have a double stroller, and I'm wanting to get one of those. And I need to get some bottle nipples and diapers, but that's pretty much it. Oh, and a diaper bag. If anybody knows where to get a cute little diaper bag, I want to get a diaper bag with that I can put his name on it. Sawyer had one like that, but the person that made Sawyer's diaper bag um, is not going to be making those for a while with like the holiday season and everything. So I need to find somebody that can make a cute little diaper bag with his, with Jameson's name on it. Um, okay, what else? Room situation. Um, so we decided that, um, Ow. what we're going to do is Ow. we got Sawyer a big boy bed. Yeah. And it doesn't really fit well in his room, the way his room is laid out. And so what we're going to do is we are going to put Sawyer in the guest bedroom. And we're going to put baby Jameson in Sawyer's room. And... <laughs> And it just fits better that way. So Sawyer's gonna um, hit, we're we're gonna work on Sawyer's new room. My brother's been visiting with us and staying in that room right now. So, but he is going to be gone by um, the time we get home from picking up the baby. So then I'll really start working on Sawyer's room. But for the first like six months, Jameson's gonna sleep um, in our room with Brett and I, and. Um, He'll be right there by us or next to us. So uh, I have time to work on that. But, um, so here. Give me that. I can't reach it. I can't reach it. I can't reach it. <laughs> okay. So travel dates. We are going to be, le we are going to leave next Wednesday. We are driving out of state and it'll take us about 20 hours to get there. I don't know if we're going to stop or not, but um, we've done this drive several times. It's a very beautiful drive, and um, we're prepared. We got Sawyer a little uh, video thing so we can watch videos in the car, and I'm really looking for it. We, cho we chose to drive because it's. we just thought it would be really hard to fly with all the extra baby stuff that we need to take, and we don't know how long we're going to have to stay out of state. We can't come home <clears throat> until that state and Texas state, both their laws, <coughs> both sets of laws approve of us coming home so we couldn't we didn't want to buy an open-ended ticket and that would just cost so much money so we just thought it'd be easier to drive so other than that that's really not a whole lot's been going on just kind of getting a few things here and there um i do talk to this girl uh weekly just about and um i get excited every time i talk to her she just um i just love her more every time i talk to her and I guess one thing, um, one happy, sad part of everything is that um, as it gets closer, one thing that you go through as an adoptive mom is <clears throat> you start feeling a lot of guilt. And I just, I remember breaking down in the hospital with Sawyer thinking, how am I going to do this? How, I love these people so much. How am I going to take this baby home? And I just, it was just so hard for me to wrap my brain around. And um, I don't know how it's going to be with this baby. I don't know how it's, um, I don't really know how I'm going to do. 
but I'm going to try to vlog it as much as I can. And I'm sorry. I always say, hey, I'm going to make a video, and then I never can. Obviously, Sawyer keeps me very busy. He's in sleep right now, so I'm able to make this video. But um, I just, I don't know. I'm just praying that everything will be okay. And I have a very comforting feeling that it will. So other than that, there's not a whole lot more to update about.